Picture a special drink for your plants, like a magical potion that makes them grow super strong. When you water your young plants with it, they become thicker, sturdier, and healthier. It's like giving them a turbo boost for their growth. This mix is full of good stuff. Things like nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. The stuff plants really need to stay healthy. But it's even better than that. It's also loaded with amino acids, vitamins, and hormones that make your plants grow even better. And here's the best part. You can use it at every stage of your plant's life, from tiny seedlings to fully grown plants. Just give them a dose of this mix and watch them thrive. It's like giving your plants a secret weapon for unstoppable growth. This special drink is called Jadum Liquid Fertilizers. Jadum Liquid Fertilizers are nutrient solutions extracted from organic materials using microorganisms in an anaerobic process called putrefaction. They are easy to make and provide both the plants and soil benefits far beyond the average store-bought fertilizers. Now let's talk about how to make this special liquid fertilizer using simple 5-gallon buckets. To make liquid fertilizer, you need three main ingredients, leaf mold, organic material, and water. You can collect leaf mold in nearby forested areas. As the name suggests, leaf mold is the dark, soft, fluffy, soil-like material, usually found under piles of decaying leaves or logs. Collect your organic materials. You can use just about anything, including human waste. However, I suggest sticking to plant materials. They are easy to work and even easier to find. Cut various grasses, wild plants, weeds, or even leftover crop materials. Collect some non-chlorinated water. Ideally, you can use rainwater or get some from a river. However, if you only have access to tap water, allow it to rest for 24 hours to allow the chlorine to escape. With your ingredients in hand, it's now time to start the process. Place the organic material into the 3 gallons bucket, leaving about 3 inches free from the top. You do not need to cut it up into smaller pieces, but doing so doesn't hurt either. Sprinkle a handful or two of leaf mold onto the organic material. Pour the non-chlorinated water into the bucket until it covers the content. Cover the bucket loosely with a lid or cloth to allow air circulation. Place the bucket in a warm, sunny spot for fermentation. The fermentation process typically takes about one to two weeks, depending on the temperature. Stir the mixture daily to aerate it and promote fermentation. This helps break down the organic matter and encourages the growth of beneficial microorganisms. After one to two weeks, the liquid should be dark and have a fermented smell. Strain the liquid through a fine mesh sieve or cloth to remove solid particles. Dilute the Jadum liquid fertilizer before using it on plants. The recommended dilution ratio is typically one part fertilizer to 50 parts water. However, you can adjust the dilution ratio based on the needs of your plants. Store any leftover Jadum liquid fertilizer in sealed containers in a cool, dark place. It can be stored for several months. The easiest way to support our work is to like the video. You click the following button, then on the bell, and finally, confirm the bell. This means a lot to us. Thank you for your support.